Today I took you with me as I battled through a day of high anxiety and depression. Please know that you're never alone in your struggle. Right, this is coming to you, not from a place of giving advice or sharing tips and tricks on what to do when you're getting to a place of high anxiety. This is coming from a place of me being in the middle of an anxiety attack. And what have I been doing? I've been lying in my bed. It's almost midday. I know that's not good for me. Everyone tells me it's not good for me. The books do. The YouTube channels do. But I've been lying in my bed. So what I've done, I've got up and I'm walking. And I'm walking and I'm going to walk and I'm going to walk and I'm going to walk. And I'm going to check back in with you. I'm still walking. If I'm puffing, please excuse it, and it is a bit windy too. I hope you can hear me. I'm walking quite fast. I'm going to try some affirmations now. I'm going to try and fill my head with, with something positive. I'm so grateful that I'm fit and strong enough to walk. I'm so grateful that I'm fit and strong enough to walk. It's going. I'm now going to go inside and I'm not going to slump down. I'm going to jump into the shower and then I think I'll start cleaning a room. I'm going to keep busy. Not going to catch me today. No, no, no. Just in case. <laughs> You were thinking that things go to plan. <clears throat> yeah. So, next time you get this massive anxiety attack, you're going to go, right, I'm going to do what Rose did. I'm going to get out there and walk. And then I'm going to go back inside and get on with my day. Well, as I got back to my gate, oh, I couldn't do it. I had to just keep on walking again. But I'm going to keep on walking. I'm going to keep on walking. I'm going to walk away from this. I'm walking. We're doing this together today, guys. No tips and tricks today. You and me finding a way out of massive anxiety. working today guys made myself a cup of coffee sitting in the garden it's a beautiful day I'm so tired of doing all the right things the right things that are supposed to work
and care how I feel. I'm going to say the words. My thoughts are my words, are my actions. My thoughts will become my words, will become my actions. I'm so grateful that I'm physically well and healthy. And I could go for that walk this morning. I'm so grateful for this place that I'm sitting. The birds around me. I can see trees. I'm so grateful for having had something to eat today. I'm so grateful for the roof over my head. I'm grateful for my husband. I'm so grateful for my children and my family. I'm so grateful for everybody who loves me. My thoughts are my words are my deeds. I'm grateful. I am so grateful that I do have medication to help me through these really bad days. When I make videos and I put them on YouTube, it's my desire to help you feel that you're not alone. Your pain and your mental health journey and I was just wondering now if I feel any less alone and I think I do feel less alone because we talk about this now we don't hide it away anymore and I'll say I'm tired of doing all the things that don't work but they will work. They will. I'll get through another day. Like you will get through another day. And they will work. And tomorrow will be a better day. So we are better together. If there's anybody else who's feeling really low today, or feels so tired there is someone who cares I care about you I care about you I know people care about me and I care about you please know that